Welcome to the Gaia 3D tutorial, labeling your objects. Gaia 3D Viewer software allows you to create custom labels to help you customize your lessons. There are two main uses for labels. Creating labels for new objects and editing existing labels. First, we'll create labels for new objects. This is useful for labeling an object you have imported into the software yourself. First, click the object you want to label. Then press on the Labels button. Click New. And enter the title you want for your label group. We'll call this label group English, then click OK. Now click the group title you just made and click Load. Once loaded, double click the area you want to add a label to. We will label a window. Now drag your mouse to create a pointer. And double click again to end the pointer. Type in your label text. You can now change some of your label settings. These include the language, the color and the font size. You can adjust the font size using the scale slider. Don't be confused by the red text. Labels that are being edited will glow red. Once you click off them, you will see that the font color you choose is there. You can repeat the labeling process as much as you want. You can also delete labels by selecting them first and then clicking delete. When you're happy with your label, click save. Once you finish labeling, click back to return to the main menu. Next, we'll edit existing labels. This is ideal for making labels in additional languages or customizing lessons for different learning levels. In this example, we will show you how to create labels in a new language. And in this case, we'll use Spanish. First, we'll duplicate an existing label group. We will duplicate our English labels. So click the English group and then duplicate. Type in a name for this copy of the labels and click OK. Click the label title you just made and click Load. You'll see of course that the labels are in English because they've been duplicated. You simply select the label text then click Edit. Now type over the existing text. Click save when you're finished and then click back to return to the main menu. You have the option to share your labels with other colleagues or import labels that colleagues have given to you. If you would like to share your labels, click on the label you have created and click export. Select your file name and press save. That concludes the tutorial on how to label your objects. Please visit Gaia3D.co.uk 
for advanced demos including creating lessons and designing your own objects.